keeping your bike clean is so important. Your components won't wear out as quickly and your bike will perform a lot better. I usually ride in pretty good conditions, although I did get caught in the rain, so my bike is filthy. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to clean your bike without the use of water. I realize that many pro mechanics hose team bikes down, but that's because they have the skills to disassemble and build bikes whenever they want. Most cyclists don't have those skills. So this way of cleaning your bike is going to be convenient if you live in an apartment like I do, but also a safer method so you won't have to risk water getting inside your bearings. So let's begin. You're gonna need a cleaning solution lube some dry rags, a bike stand, and some sort of cover to keep your floor clean. The first thing you'll want to do is focus on the drivetrain. Start off by running the chain through a rag to get any dirt off the surface. Then bend the chain so it forms an S shape through the rag. This will help you get any dirt off between the links. After your chain is somewhat clean, run the rag through all of your cogs to clean your cassette. Next, move on to your wheel pulleys as well as your chain rings to wipe off any buildup. Then run the rag again through your chain to get off any last bit of dirt. Now that your drivetrain is clean, it's time to wipe down the frame. I recommend spraying any solution onto a rag and not on the frame to assure an even distribution. I personally start cleaning from the top and move my way down the bike. The places that require a lot of cleaning will be the down tube, the fork, and the rear triangle where the wheels are constantly picking up dirt. Then wipe down your brake calipers and run the rag through any gaps in your brake pads because dirt that gets in there can wear out your rims. After that, clean your front and rear derailleurs, cranks, power meter, and pedals. Once your frame is clean, use a rag to get any dirt off your tire's surface and wipe down your rims, spokes, and hubs. Then put your rear wheel on to loop your chain. All you need here is a light coating. Then shift through all your gears so that your chain bends at different angles, allowing the lube to get where it needs to. Then simply wipe off the excess so that your chain doesn't pick up dirt on your next ride. You want your chain to be really clean so that when you run your bare hands through it, it is really clean. And congrats, your bike is now looking super fresh. So definitely feel free to tweak this in any way you want to make it work for your setup, but Without a doubt, it's going to make your bike last much longer and have it looking super cool on those group rides. Let me know if you guys found this video useful by giving it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button down below for more videos on cycling. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you in the next video.